I'm here at the North Metro Ice Show checking out the latest ice fishing gear this year, so check out the other videos in the playlist and let's jump in. I'm Shane with 3A Outdoors and we're here at the North Metro Ice Show. This is some of the products that we have designed and developed. Uh, we don't do Me Too products. Uh, what we have here is our flagship product, which we call the Mai Tai. The Mai Tai is a knot tying device that allows people like me with poor eyesight or maybe frozen fingers to be able to tie the improved clinch knot much easier. So there is an embedded magnet on the front of this Mai Tai. We take our hook, we're going to put it on the head of the Mai Tai, and that lines the eyelet of the hook up with this channel on top of the Mai Tai head. We're then going to take our fishing line and we're going to lay it right down in the channel and it goes right through the eyelet on that hook. I'm gonna then take the fishing line. This would be the part of the fishing line that goes back to my fishing rod and I'm gonna capture it with my hand. I'm gonna keep these two fingers free. I'm gonna take this end, wrap it around the island, down through the middle and pull up enough slack and grab it with my finger and thumb. Now, depending on how thick your line is, you're going to give it the appropriate amount of twists. So for this case, I'm just gonna give it a few twists and we're gonna stop in the up position. We're then gonna take that line and we're going to pass it back through from the underside up through the middle, pull it out like that and grasp it with my finger and thumb again. Take the hook off of the device and complete my knot. Now this works with the jig as well. However, the jig would go into the aperture on the side and be held in place with your finger while you are threading the jig and it just threads real easily, just, just like that. Buddy Heater, which happens to be one of our favorite products for using in our ice houses, is generally used with a green uh, one pound bottle. And we found that sometimes green one pound bottles get hard to come by. So we developed a replacement base and a torch bottle adapter that allows us to use torch bottles in our base or in the base that comes with the buddy heater. That just makes it a little bit easier to use uh, in the event that supply chains cause problems with getting green bottles. In the rattle reel world, there are a number of different products out there and most of them are lacking a really nice base. So we've determined that making really nice bases for rattle reels was a good idea. This would be a simple base for holding a rod or a rattle reel could be mounted into this area as well. Uh, so you could use it for a rattle reel or your rod interchangeably. This is one version of our fishing station. This one features a screw on cap on the bait cup and the screw on cap also features a magnet inside for holding your, ta your tackle while you're changing hooks or what have you. We have a tackle rack that is built into the product and it is easily removable at the end of the day when you wanna dump out your bait and start over clean. The interface between our fishing station and the mount for it is compatible with catch cover. Uh, so if you have catch cover in your rig currently, this will work in your catch cover pucks. This one threads on. We have another option that allows for a lift off. And this lift off, unfortunately, hasn't been fully assembled, but it should have this weight storage area inside of it as well. The whole idea here is to put the fishermen in charge of how many different things they want to bring out with them without having to have all their pockets full. This puts lots of things in one place. Our patent pending ratchet reel is a new take on the rattle reel market in that it doesn't have bells, it doesn't have lights, and it doesn't have beads inside. It has a ratcheting pole, and when it rotates, it makes, it makes a ratcheting sound. That ratcheting sound does two things. It alerts the fishermen that they've got a bite, and in addition to that, it will also create just enough drag that if you take an aggressive hit from a large fish, it's going to reduce the chance that you're going to have a spool out of your entire spool onto the floor of your fish house. This can also be tightened up. It has a threaded nut on the front and you can put as much pressure on it as you like. This goes on our fishing station. Our fishing station is interchangeable with the catch cover puck if that's what your wheelhouse currently has. As far as additional accessories go, for some reason we have been unable to find a male adapter for the catch cover puck. And because we also make something that is compatible with that, we made this male adapter for the catch cover puck that will allow you to mount it to anything you like that can then be mounted inside of the catch cover puck or it can be mounted inside of our base if that's what you have. Now my fish house, I don't like to carry a full-size car battery in there and there's lots of options out 
out there that can bring power into your fish house. But I like this one here. It is a universal adapter that allows you to use this device, which transforms the power of drill batteries down into a 12 volt output. And this 12 volt output is 240 watts. We make this here in Burnsville, and it is able to be used with the DeWalt battery, the Milwaukee battery, or the Bauer battery. If you're using it with the DeWalt battery, you pull up this keyway, take your DeWalt battery, and lock it in place. If you'd like to use it with a Milwaukee battery instead, you put the keyway down and you lock it in place. There's a switch on the bottom. When the switch is on, you have 12 volts of power across these battery lugs here, or an output here, or an output there. So it's a universal adapter, and it also works with the less expensive Bauer battery that's available uh, as well. Awesome, so if anybody wants to know where to pick these up or wants to get them, where can they go? They can contact us right here in Burnsville, Minnesota at 3aoutdoors.com. 